In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to assemble the Raspad 3 step by dash step. First, open the box and take out all the components inside. There are Raspad 3, charger, some cables, fan and other small accessories. Now flip the Raspad over and use the included screwdriver to remove the fixing screws. Then the back cover can be removed now. Insert the micro SD card board into the Raspberry Pi. After that, secure the Raspberry Pi with 4M to 0.5 by 4 screws. Then comes the step that requires the most care. Gently pulling up the tab with two fingers and insert the FFC cable completely without any tilt. Finally, push the plastic clip back down. Pull up the tab gently again if it is not attached properly. Plug in the Ethernet cable. You may need to use a little force to plug in the USB to USB cable. In the kit, there are two micro HDMI cables, the shorter one is plugged in first. Then plug in the longer micro HDMI cable. Finally, plug in a Type-C cable to power the Raspberry Pi. Insert the Excel Shin module for the Raspberry's auto rotate function. Now apply heat sinks to the MCU, RAM and Wi-Fi Bluetooth chips of the Raspberry Pi. A fan comes with the kit, which you can mount on the back and make sure fan label side faces inward. Fasten the fan with PWA 1.7 X9 screws. and then plug the fan cable into the main board. After making sure everything is in place, flip the back cover over and put it on. And secured with them to 0.5 by 4 screws. Once the Raspad is assembled, push the microSD card into the spring or loaded slot with your finger. The microSD card is also removed using the same method. Now press and hold the power button to turn on the Raspad. Raspad is working properly when the Raspberry Pi desktop appears. The video is over. Thank you for watching. You can subscribe us to get the latest videos. Or visit www.sunfounder.com to see more information about the product.